Hey CFS Warriors, it's Victoria coming to you from the beach in Mexico. I'm about to lose my light, but I just want to talk to you about brain rehearsal. And you know, it's so interesting how um, we're doing brain rehearsal all the time, even though we're not aware of it. So just a, a, a little snippet, you know, I, I listened a lot to Dennis Waitley years ago. He worked with Olympic athletes and what they discovered was that as an athlete was visualizing their performance, their muscles were actually firing off signals to the brain. So brain rehearsal is really critical. He had done a whole program on winners and it showed that winners tend to visualize and use brain rehearsal for a good outcome in their performance. And I just think it's, it's a, a key and a tool that we cannot overlook in CFS recovery is we wanna get our bodies in line with where we wanna go. And I know for me, when I would crash, um, as I began to progress, those crashes became less and less of a duration. They lasted less time each time. But what was interesting is how when I would do something, I would think, oh no, I'm gonna overdo it and I'm gonna crash. And just, you know, and I could kind of, or I'd, I'd visualize it. I didn't even realize this, but I was visualizing in my mind uh, what might happen to me, like, oh my gosh, I'll be in bed for days, or oh, that'll just be so awful. And I would just kind of think, oh yeah, it's just gonna make me so exhausted. And you know, it's interesting because I think we set things up when we do that. It doesn't mean that CFS isn't a physical illness, but it means we've been punished so many times that we just start to expect it. And so what I wanna encourage you to do, and I've been doing this and it's been really helpful, is when I become aware of that, when I catch myself, oh my gosh, I've done all this stuff, or if I go do all that stuff, I'm gonna feel really bad. I go, wait. I visualize instead, what if, I get a nice little rest after that, and I actually do well after that. So I actually kind of visualize feeling well after the activity, whatever it may be. Now this is not pushing yourself. This does not mean go out and push yourself and visualize you're feeling good. It just means, okay, if that's within my baseline and I'm able to do it, let me just picture myself recovering really easily and really well from that. Again, CFS is a physical illness and we need to support our bodies physically, but I think it's so critical to get our brain involved in the process because that mind-body connection is really important. So anyway, warriors, hope you're having a good day and wishing you very well. And remember, life is not over, it's starting again. Leave a comment, let me know, what have you been rehearsing in your brain? Has it been good stuff or bad stuff? And if it's been bad, what kind of good stuff are you gonna start uh, rehearsing and visualizing to help move yourself forward in recovery? And you can use some more encouragement, be sure to subscribe. And if you like the video, give it a thumbs up, that lets me know, and it also helps it reach more people that can use some encouragement that might be in some dark places. Thanks.